Yes, it's time to go to Wales. Well, it's nine o'clock now and we're in Cheveley services on the M4 uh, and we've done well we're halfway uh, we've done really well left about five o'clock and uh, we've been driving now uh, for about we were driving for about three and a half hours we just had a half an hour break or so and uh, we're in with the lorries as you do but uh, it's all been freshly done here so it's really nice plenty of space so we'll get back on the road and uh, We'll see you at Pembrey Country Park in uh, just a couple of minutes.
to Pembrey Country Park, Caravan and Motorhome Club site. And uh, we've been here a couple of hours now, just had lunch and uh, put up our little pop-up gazebo. Parks Bertie on the pitch. And uh, let me show you, we're tucked up in the corner, I'll show you where we are. Really lovely site and guess what? The sun's come out as well, which is even better. We've just taken a bit of a chill. Uh, it took probably about eight hours driving, um, nine hours in total. We took an hour uh, break along the M4 and had a bit of breakfast and uh, put our feet up for a little while, walked the dogs and uh, just got a little refreshed before we started the second half of the journey. But um, travel day is always uh, nice to just settle down, get pitched up and then uh, well chill really and now I've come to the other side of the pitch just under the trees here and as you can see lots of grass so there's plenty of space there really is plenty of space if I walk along here you see there's uh, Sheila and Joe's motorhome right next to us over here on this pitch and uh, you'll see a little Ethel tucked away there. Loads of space. It's just really pleasant sight. Well, here we are at the entrance to Pembrey Country Park Caravan and Motorhome Club site, and this is the uh, reception area where arrivals are checked in and then there's a nice secure barrier system through into the park the information room And the usual high standard facilities block in the centre of the park 